But um, George Washington's first Thanksgiving proclamation, he's, he states here in 1789, so this is at the end of the Revolutionary War. We're supposed to he be says, whereas it is the duty of all nations to acknowledge the providence of Almighty God, to obey His will, to be grateful for His benefits, and humbly to employ His protection and favor, and whereas both houses of Congress have by their joint, joint committee requested me to recommend to the people of the United States a day of public thanksgiving and prayer to be observed by, by acknowledging with grateful hearts that many and single favors of Almighty God, especially by affording them an opportunity peaceably to establish a form of government for their safety and happiness. I think if our president said that today, he might get in trouble with the ACLU. But, you know, oh, so, very oh, nice. Yeah. 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 We definitely have a lot to be thankful for. We so do. let's pray. Yeah, for sure. Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you for today. And uh, we thank you that we can celebrate and have a day of Thanksgiving to be reminded that you look back of all the wonderful things you've done for us. Thank you for these beautiful children that you bless mm -hmm. us with. And uh, thank you, Lord, for the gift of family. Bless our time that we have together, Lord. We know that uh, life really is short, so help us to make the most of every opportunity we have and just to uh, enjoy the time we have with each other. Bless us through our body. We thank you for it. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Wonderful. Let me help you, 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 Let me help